Hi there. Well, this one is uh, to show you my new Sting acquisitions. And uh, in tribute, I'm wearing a T-shirt with four Newcastle Brown bottles. Those of you in the know will know all that's about. Anyway, um, I'd shown you recently some CDs that I'd picked up um, of Sting's solo work, etc., and uh, I thought, well, I'll hunt out and, you know, build up the collection a bit. So some have been secondhand. Several have been secondhand. That showed you the other day. And um, th this is a mixture of secondhand and new. This is, uh, here we go. Sting 57th and 9th. It's in one of those cardboard cardboard covers and uh, it's still sealed up that so because uh, I've only just acquired it you see this one um, I'd seen some of this on TV Sting live in Berlin featuring the Royal Philharmonic Concert Orchestra and card cover again I don't really, I'm not really sure how I feel about these, but still, I don't like the jewel cases because, because they are a pain. And there we have it, the DVD and the CD. And uh, it's got, if I ever lo my, lose my faith in you Englishmen in New York, fields of gold, why should I cry for you all would envy tomorrow we'll see the end of the game whenever I say your name shape of my heart moon over Bourbon Street uh, mad about you king of pain desert rose and fragile and then there's um, I think there's a little bit extra on the DVD I won't, I won't run through all those titles anyway let's put that one down cardboard sleeve again this is the Super Deluxe 2 CD album of The Bridge um, featuring singles If It's Love, Rushing Water, three bonus tracks, CD2, uh, six tracks from uh, FIP session live in Paris at the Pantheon, um, liner notes by Sting. There he's got his hands behind his back. He's obviously done something he shouldn't. Um, so that's that's sealed up. Uh, let's have a look at these the last few here. Uh, an earlier one here. This is uh, 1987, and it's nothing like the sun. Englishman in New York that crops up a lot on uh, you know, various albums. I've lost count the number of greatest hits albums of Sting's, and I know that he was approached over doing a new album, and he, he assumed that they were going to do a, another greatest hits one again, which apparently he wouldn't agree to that again because I think people are getting a bit fed up with the same material, just repackaged. Uh, this is Jewel Case Sting, brand new, New Day. And he's obviously uh, waiting there patiently um, for a lift. Or is he in the lift? I think he might be in the lift. Because if you can see, all the buttons are there. Uh, Desert Rose, Thousand Years, After the Rain Has Fallen. Some long tracks on that. And then finally, this one. Uh, Symphon... Symphon Cities, uh, Sting's greatest hits reimagined for symphonic arrangement. Englishman in New York, every little thing she does is magic. Roxanne, featuring the Royal Philharmonic uh, Concert Orchestra. Now, there's a booklet inside here. Um, let's have a look. Let's see what's what's in here. This is under a Deutsch gramophone as well. It's a very um, prestigious label, that. Um, I used to have a lot of classical records on the Deutsch gramophone label. The pressings are always great. 
produced by Rob Matthews and Sting. All songs arranged by Rob Matthews, except I Hung My Head, arranged by David Hartley. You Will Be My Ain, My Iron True Love, and When We Danced, arranged by Steve Mercurio. Um, mastered by Scott Hall at Master Disc New York. And then, a good thing here is, the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra, it gives a breakdown of all the members of that orchestra and what they played uh, so that, that should be quite interesting to read there anyway it kept when, when I bought this um, there was the cardboard cardboard case anyway and there was an elastic band done in a rather peculiar way around this now I really do wish that I had been able to get the DVD of this uh, which I thought was in in the package uh, but I'm not sure actually if the DVD is available whether that's as a standalone or whether it's in another uh, edition of this that includes the DVD I, that I just don't know but it took um, it took it took about 10 days I think for this to to come and I bought it through Amazon, um, but it's uh, a, a company selling their stuff. And it was obviously not a brand new copy, but there again, hey ho, I buy a lot of things they used because uh, that's where you try and get a bargain if you possibly can. Well, if you've any views on any of these albums, any of these CDs, as many people call them these days, or discs, uh, let me know and. Um, You'll tell me, obviously, to tell me lots of things that I don't know. I hope you've enjoyed seeing this anyway. Maybe you've got a massive sting collection. Okay, bye for now. Have a great day.